here and today I want to talk about gym hairstyles. If you've got long thick hair like me then having that bothering you while you're just trying to work out is the worst thing ever. You just want your hair to stay out of the way, let you get on and do your thing. Trying to go to the gym before work or after work, or maybe you've got the gym smack bang in the middle of school, then you kind of want this hairstyle to work and be cute even in the daytime. That's my cue to help out. <laughs> if you like this video please do give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and let's get on with the rest of the video. For the first hairstyle you are just going to want to section your hair down the middle so you can take a rat tail comb or I just do this with my fingers, take it all the way down to the back because you are about to create two braids. So these are just literally a normal three strand braid, you know, elementary style, but I just think it looks really cute for the gym. So you take your hair into three pieces and then bring each outside piece into the middle in turn. If you guys don't know how to do a braid, there will be many more in-depth tutorials on how to do a simple braid like this, but literally you just take whichever outside piece and bring it into the middle, and then you take the piece on the other side and bring that into the middle as well. And when I do this, I like to leave some strands of hair out the front, like a fringe, so if you wanted to do this on the side, you could do it that way and give yourself a side fringe, but I wanted to do this in the middle and give myself a centre part and curtains basically and then when you are done with your braids just tie them up and put a cap on top so i'm loving this white cap for summer it looks really clean and fresh kind of tennis vibes this one is from satin lined caps i've had it for about a year now and i love it and i love the look but if you don't have a hat it doesn't matter i think this look is really cute even without a hat for the next look, we don't need a centre part, so I'm just going to brush that away. Then with the top part of my hair, I'm just going to twist that once and push it forward just to give myself some volume up the top. And then I'm going to bring up the rest of my hair into a ponytail and I'm going to tie that with one of these little scrunchies. I'll show you these in more detail in just a sec. They hold my hair really well, so they are perfect for the gym. My ponytail actually doesn't slip down. So I just want to make sure that I've got some volume on the top there so that I can put a headband on top. And I really like this look when it kind of gives me two bumps, like a bump before the band and a bump afterwards, just to kind of show that I have a lot of volume there. I don't like it when it's really slick and sleek onto my head. So that is the final look for that one. I think it looks really sporty and really studious. So for the next one, it's pretty much exactly the same, but I don't like to leave my hair out completely. Because my hair is really thick, like I said, and if it's on my neck, then that can make me really hot and it can get sweat into my hair if I'm doing a real good workout. So I take my hair into two sections and I twist them into this kind of twist. So just watch carefully what I'm doing because I can't really explain it very well. I take each section and I twist it around the twist. For the next one, I'm bringing back the centre part and I'm going to take my curtains that were previously left out and I'm actually just going to tie those into two braids and I'm going to pin them back at the back of my head. So I could leave that if I just wanted to do that for the daytime and then when it comes around to the gym, I am going to then tie my hair back with the two braids. So for me, this just means that I'm not going to have to worry about any flyaways or my fringe coming loose out of my hair tie. I feel like bobby pins really struggle sometimes to hold my hair back and I'm having to constantly pin my fringe back. So I always like to wear a headband or I put my hair into braids like this. So that's the final look for that one. I think that one's great for school or in the office. It just looks really cute in general. So I always like to wear a cap if I'm going for a run outdoors and that way the sun isn't going to get in my eyes and bother me or anything like that. I can just carry on running and reaching my fitness goals. Thank you guys for watching. I really hope that you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. That just really helps other people to see the video. So if you liked it and you think other people will like it as well, then don't forget to do that. Also, don't forget to subscribe. I make new videos every single week and I always try to reply to every single comment on my newest videos. So leave a comment on this one and I will get back to you and I will see you in the next one as well. Thanks again for watching. Bye. I know that you'll be coming back.